How's it going everyone? My name is Adrian and welcome back to Visage Chapter 2. If you're wondering why I'm sweating already, it's because it's a million degrees in my life. Alright, so I've realized now that I've been being an idiot. Been being. Because there's a lot of stuff that I think I'm missing that I just wasn't paying attention to. First and foremost, I want to see if I can find a light bulb. Oh god. Because... Okay, you can, you can stop that. You can... Oh, the breakers again? All right, this is bad news. This is really bad news. Okay, I need to... I need to get a lighter. Oh, this is really bad news. This is really bad news. I'm about to fucking go crazy. Why would you do that to me right now as I was finally about to make some progress? Something goes wrong and now I gotta go all the way down to the basement again. Oh my god. Maybe it's a blessing in disguise because I think I could surely find a flashlight in the basement. Alright, let's go in here. Okay. Let's go into the breaker room. Now I know I put a candle... Not too far from here. Yeah, let's light this bad boy up. There we go. And now I have something to uphold my sanity with temporarily. For some reason, it looks a bit brighter in this house. Wait, okay. Everything's fixed now. The lights are now fixed. Now, let me pick this here. Let me first... Before I ruin everything, let me... Pick this up. Put this in here. I wish I could find more flashlights. Or, uh, light bulbs. But I think I might be SOL for that. Aha! There's another one here. Alright, let me, uh, do, 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 do. Let me drop this. Pick this up. Pop that right there. And pick these pills up again. Swap them for the flashlight. Or the lighter. Now I have two light bulbs. Very nice. Very good. Okay, so I thought this doll might be something that I need for Dolores. What's in there? Nothing. I don't have a vinyl on the phonograph. Okay, is that her sweater? So, okay, one of the things that I was thinking is not actually the case. And what that was was that this doll down here might be what Dolores thinks is her child. I was wrong about that. So let's turn these lights on so I don't go cuckoo bananas. How about you stop flickering lights on me, you asshole? The next thing that I realized I'm a stupid idiot for, and this I actually looked it up is that I can go here. I was not paying attention to this before, but I can absolutely positively shimmy my way through here. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy till the break of dawn and escape over here. So there, I've solved the issue of this door that I thought was inaccessible. My dynamic inventory is full now. <sighs> Okay, there's a bunch of crosses in here. Can I not go over to that door? I want to go to that door. Well, it looks like I got to crouch. Oh, God. This does not seem safe for my sanity, but here we go. Interact. Aha! So now up here we go. This is an entirely new area for me. have not experienced this yet. Now I must say I did have to kind of lower some of the graphics settings because this game is very demanding graphics wise. And I noticed a lot of stutter in the past. It seems to be running a lot smoother now though. This is very intriguing. Aha! Frank. I have one of those. I just gotta put my face right up into the crank and then it does the thing. 
There's a person on there. Unless that's just a statue. Jesus Christo. I'm hoping it's the latter because I don't like encountering actual... Yeah, it's just a statue. Oh. Okay, yes. Things are starting to come together now. Yes. All right, so that knife, I definitely have to take that knife to... Oh. Definitely have to take that knife to that dude. But wait. Why do I feel like that door that was ahead of me? Whatever. I'm not going to worry about it now. I'm just going to take the knife up to the dude and do the stuff. Okay, it's saving. Yes, I'm finally making some progress now. All right, we got the crowbar and the sledgehammy over there. Oh, the sledgehammer. The sledgehammer. I need that. Fuck. Oh, I have too many, too many dynamic items. All right, uh, I'm gonna have to come back here. Why is it so hard to open now? There we go. I'm gonna have to come back here to grab that sledgehammer because there's another mirror that I missed. Trust me, Dolores, I wanna bring you your child. Bring me my child. But you're gonna have to wait because I gotta stab this dude up with the knife. Okay, everything is dark. And let me guess, she's gonna be stand. Oh, prove me wrong. There we go. Okay. So I feel like I should avoid going this way. No. Yeah, I'm gonna avoid that because I heard some very weird, very scary noises there. Okay, all right. All right, she was standing right there. She was standing right there and she was naked. Oh, I'm gonna have to do some blurring. I'm sorry everyone for the nudity. Okay. All right. Oh, it's too fucking dark. It's too fucking dark. Where's that fucking light switch? Oh God. Oh my God, okay. Maybe she knows I have the knife now. She wants to prevent me from getting this guy with it. All right. What I'm going to do. Oh. <laughs> is put the light bulb in here. This light is not. What the fuck do you mean? Oh, because I. Wait. I just. Okay. I guess I just can't turn it on. Whatever. Single knife seems to have been removed. Well, I got the puzzle piece right here. There you go. About to get stabbed up. Oh, God. This is about to be extremely grotesque. Everyone shield your eyes. Oh, my God. Do you have to stare up at him? Oh. I feel like he's going to come to life. Oh, God. about being in the same room as that dude. Alright, he's still there. Oh, okay. Oh. Huh. Another tape. George's Memento Master. Oh, that's George. Oh, of course. Of course. Of course. Ugh. Come on. Open. God. Damn it. There we go. Blood bags? It's jammed. Maybe I can use the crowbar to unjam it. Oh, 
Okay, I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Looks like I gotta face my fears here. What do you have to say? Oh, okay. You're gonna stab me now. Well, there we go. Are you just, you're just gonna continuously stab me? Oh man, this is pretty dark. So I'm gonna have to come back here because I can't have this happen again. Why is it so fucking dark over here? Oh, I'm scared to encounter Dolores again. <sighs> okay. Alright, time to go in the basement again. Oh man. I feel like I'm definitely gonna need the crowbar to get through that door because there's no other way to get around him. I think he's always gonna... He's always gonna catch me. Oh man, they definitely upped the spook factor with this game. With this chapter, I mean. Oh, cause it's a lot creepier. A lot creepier than the first chapter. I really, I really feel that way. So I'm gonna have to do some maneuvers real quick. Uh... I'm gonna have to... Let me drop a couple of the light bulbs down here somewhere. Should probably drop them upstairs where they're more useful. Let's pick this one up and drop it. And now let's put the compass in here. And then grab the crowbar. And then make our way back upstairs. I'm sorry I had to take another deviation, but... It's just the way it is. Is she going to be right there? Nope, okay. Okay, no, 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 no. I'm going the other way. I'm going the other way. See, she's fucking everywhere, dude. Is she gonna be right here again? Nope, okay, we're good. No, 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 no. Dolores. Can you please stop? I got a crowbar in hand, okay? You're not gonna wanna deal with me with crowbar in hand. I'm telling you this right now. Alright, time to visit your good old husband, Georgie Poo. Uh, let's go ahead and save. Oh, I can't save. I think it auto saves when I do the thing and stuff. So let's go ahead and. Did I already? Oh, yeah, I already have the, okay. Okay, so I don't have to go through stabbing him again. I just gotta open this. I hope I made the right move. Pry this open. It's jammed. Well, what the fuck then? I did all that for nothing. All right, that door's closed. I guess he's still gonna be there, isn't he? No? Okay. He better not be around the fucking corner or some shit. All right, well, goodbye, George. Okay, I did it. I guess you just have to close the door on him. Can I open this and go in here? Okay, yeah. All right, so. Wait. Oh! Oh! Okay, 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 okay. Okay. All right. All right, so I need to find more of those. Oh, I had no idea. Okay, here, let's listen to this. Close. 
I fear that Dolores is getting worse by the day. Her temperaments are extremely bipolar. She gets easily upset over small things, almost always immediately followed by self-resentment and the asking for forgiveness. It's getting harder to cope with her outbursts, but my love for her is strong still, and I'll do whatever it takes to help her overcome her condition. Oh, oh no. I'm gonna be late for tea. Where did I put that damned attic hook? Was that it? Well, I already took care of the tea. Let's just take a peek in here one more time because I want to see... Yeah, those paintings there. I don't know if they have anything to do with that room with all the paintings in them. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, okay. Let me try one more thing. Uh, first of all, can I save? I'm gonna save real quick because I have a blood bag. An empty blood bag. And now that I remember, there's one of those. There's a bunch of those in here. So let me try and maybe pop that in here. Can I drop that here? I guess not. All right, well, I am unfortunately out of time for this episode, but I did make quite a bit of progress this time around. And the next episode I do, I expect to make a little bit more because there is one more mirror that I'm missing down in the basement. So I'm gonna have to go back down there in the next episode, grab the sledgehammer, smash up that mirror and see where it leads. Other than that, I really don't know what else I'm missing. So hopefully that mirror will answer some of the questions I have about this place. But for now, that's all the time I have for this episode. So thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, feel free to hit that like button down below and go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. If you like what you just watched, feel free to subscribe so you can catch a new video up to five days a week. Once again, thank you all so much for watching this video and I can't wait to see you all in the next one. Take it easy.